Hey, welcome to my video. Um, on this video, I got a bunch of the 2860 Divigo router and I got five of them here. I got some of them before but from different seller. This one is came from the UK company and the area apply is UK even though it's made in Taiwan. So the problem is it has been reset for a few times and it just can't be reset to the factory default so if you go to this router okay and we type admin Admin. If you can see on this video, the username or password you enter is incorrect. So, back to this router here. There's a reset button on this place. Normally, you need to wait like 15 seconds. So all the lights come up and all the port is flashing and it will be reset to the factory default. This is the standard procedure for reset the 2860 or similar router that from the YGO. And we back to this login page. So we type admin and admin again. The username or password you enter is incorrect. As you can see from this video, it has been reset. So for the factory firmware upgrade or firmware reset procedure, you need to turn it off. And you need to press here. While you're pressing the factory reset buttons, you need to turn on the rotor in the same time when you see this three button is on three LED is on uh, it's ready to take the firmware so back to the firmware upgrade utility 3.6.10 you need to download this utility from the YCO website and you run it as the administrator um, for the ALL or firmware, you can download this one. They got two in a folder and a RST. Uh, RST the one that resets. So if you choose the reset one, like what I'm doing here, and the router IP is the default. So you start send. When the router is flashing on this three LED, is accepting the firmware from your computers. So back to this screen here. The one I'm updating is 3898 underscore BT. Uh, this is the latest one. We're waiting the firmware to be fully updated.
So the router is active now. Um, one is the report. If you can see the LED lights on the first one. This one is the latest firmware, so you got a 2020. You try again, admin, admin. And it still won't work. So I also tried the 3893BT and the .alll file and RST file. I tried all of them. And for this bunch of the rotor, they are all useless anyway you can still use this video as a guide for resetting your Weigo and it might still not working but if you have a brick one which is like completely firmware fresh issue lost power you can try to refresh the firmware and this bunch five of them there has been resets there has been tried four type of the different firmware from the YGO website uh, I tried the ALL file, RST file I do the hard reset 30 30 30 30, 30 like you turn off the router and power on again with the reset buttons it still don't work so before you buy any used router you need to make sure the seller can accept the returns if it can't be reset. And thank you for watching this video.